everybody, this is Pastor Ben Lim here, and I believe in the season. God wants to release his staff and his rod towards you in favor. Remember, God is not a God who punishes, but he's a good father. He's a good shepherd that leads us with the staff and the rod. I want to go into Psalm 23, verse 4. The psalmist says, even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Now, isn't this interesting? Even in the middle of the darkest valley, in the valley of the shadow of death, God is there to guide you and to comfort you with the staff and his rod. You see, it doesn't matter where you are on planet Earth. You may be in a hard situation. You may be uh, in the best season of your life. It doesn't matter where you are in your lifetime. As long as Jesus is there, you will be fine. In fact, you will be better than A-OK -okay because he is the shepherd. Your setting is not as important as the one who is with you. So you could go to anywhere, but as, as long as Jesus is with you, you're going to be better than fine. I love this because the Bible says your rod and your staff. There's two different things. These are two different tools. I'm sure you've read this verse, heard this passage, and you've thought to yourself, what is a rod? And what is a staff? I believe there's a revelation in this that God wants to release to you. A rod has to do with a long, uh, in a sense, hook. Uh, and this is like a plowshare or it's like a hook that helps the sheep come out of the waters that it's been stuck in. Or it helps to gather the sheep from being scattered across the land. So the rod is for our protection. And the rod is also, in a sense, for discipline. And the rod brings us back to our senses and brings us back to who we are. It is the curly end of the staff. And it comes to collect and to gather. So God uses the rod, not just to discipline us, but to gather ourselves back to himself. God is bringing together. God is gathering in this season. Have you ever felt like you're all over the place? Have you ever felt like you're a scatterbrain? Well, God is our shepherd. And even in the valley of the darkest of nights, his rod will bring you back to where he is. The staff is on the other hand. You see, Jesus, our shepherd, has these two tools in both of his hands, the rod and the staff. And the staff, is uh, is a guide and helps the sheep to go into the right direction. So it's really a guiding staff. You see, the Lord uses justice and righteousness, judgment and mercy, hand in hand at the same time. You may say, well, Pastor Ben, isn't it just one-sided at times? I feel like I'm always getting the judgments, or getting certain disciplines and corrections. However, it's also in tandem. It goes hand in hand with the guidance of the Holy Spirit, with the mercies of God, the rod and the staff. It doesn't matter if you're in the valley or in the mountaintops. As long as the shepherd is there, Jesus Christ, he will guide you. He will protect you. He will comfort you. He will gather you to himself. I believe in the season. God wants to exercise his authority in your life. You may be in the valley, but the shepherd will guide you. He will protect you. He will walk with you. And he will gather you to yourself, to your senses. He will gather you to himself. I believe in this season, even in this journey of life, he wants to guide you and protect you. So do not fear. For though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, and your staff and your rod, they comfort me. Get ready for the comfort of the Holy Spirit like never before. With his rod and his staff, which goes hand in hand. God bless you. Let us know what blessed you. What gave you encouragement from today's short message. This is Pastor Ben Lynn.